Tamara Clark coming off the 200 meters. Just tell us how you feel. The conditions are kind of up and down today. Um, I kind of, I really feel really good. I didn't really pay attention to the weather or anything. Um, I just came out as cute and remember my race. Nice. And you transitioned. You were, of course, um, at Alabama and then you moved over to Texas and now you're training with Buford Bailey. How was that transition out of college into a professional? Um, it's actually the best decision I've ever made. Um, the environment college and pro-life is very very different so they like a practice and we always compete 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 and one of the best sprinters i have with me so it's like the best decision i've made nice and then even with that transition um outside of track just even becoming a professional becoming almost like an adult in a sense did you receive support in that transition to you know really kind of grow up and get some um you know advice in that way yeah i asked my um coach for alabama uh, i asked coach tanja advice it's to my teammates, so they give me advice on different pro life and college life, so it helps me a lot. So yeah, I have a lot of supporters. Nice. And then who were some of the people that you looked up to when you were coming up in the sport, either in track or maybe even outside of your track? Who were your, some um, of your role models? Shelly Ann. Um, I always loved Usain Bolt. Mm -hmm. um, Gabby Thomas, because she broke the record I was running that race, so I really look, look up to her, so competing with her every day is really fun. Nice. Um, and then one last question. You... You're kind of like, I don't know, you've been under the radar in a sense. I mean, you've been having a pretty, you know, up and down a little bit, but you've been pretty consistent. Of course, you ran 21 last year. What are you looking to do going into USA's this year and hopefully World Championships? Um, make a team yeah. and run 21 again is my goal. Um, and it's running a good race. I'm not really focusing on nobody else but myself. Nice. And executing. Nice. And then, of course, finally, so you did the 100, you did the 200, right? You you dabbled with maybe a couple others, but if you could do any event, not your primary events, and it could be on the track, could be on the field, what would you do? 100. You can't do the 100. That's no oh, fair. Okay. Four one. <laughs> no sprints. You, you a sprinter. You got something out there. Long jump. Long jump. Okay, that's still in the round, but why would you do long jump? Um, it seems fun. Yeah. It's like you're on your own zone, nobody else messes with you, so I actually like long jump. Nice. Excited. What, what you think you could do in long jump? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't really. I, I don't got hops, but long jump is really fun. There you go. Nice. Well, Tamara Clark, great job, and thank, thank you so much. You.